They've got a boost here. Like, Fnatic, this should be unlosable. Like, they've got such a... There's the oh. day towards Coffins, by the way. Um, we'll see. Lock the doors, Henry. He's in, He doesn't have to do much. Broadland doesn't need to find kills. Just stay there at T-Steps, force them in. Grimstar's draw. First headshot out. Oh, oh, a bit of a flush from Flusher and Punish. And now what? a flurry. Two in quick succession. Zantaras and Tamsin into the site. Smoke lands. That's just Brolin in the feed. And he needs to stay alive. He has control of the bomb. Jiggles for info. And he tries to get a fresh clip in the CZ. And through the smoke, he connects. Head of Tamsin gone. Zantaras is low. He has to be precise. And he does. Seven HP. Zantaras finds a necessary frag to win the round for big. Crims left to do his very best, but it's not looking easy. Not looking easy at all here. Crims, though, if every man to step into the plate, he could be it. Not going to happen, though. Flush, that means he can go boost the defenses towards A, and they're going to have four players outside of the map, though. They might not be there in time, though. It's a full commitment from Big. They're trying to pick up the pace with these MAC-10s and get stuck in on the A side. Yeah, Tizian, he's not going to find Brolin initially, but just as he crouches out of the smoke, the crab turned on its back. Keto looking for a second, and JW's jiggling between them. Flusher does manage to pluck one, a second as well from Graveyard. Go. Bomb does go down, though, and Fnatic working their way back into the site with a man disadvantage. I, I love those sort of approaches when you know they haven't got the incendiaries and AWP group up as a five-man unit and pounce on them. Yeah, it couldn't ask better than this, to be honest with you. No one's really died, and uh, you forced him to a push. Oh. Great shot from Prince through the smoke. That's going to be Tabson and the bomb. Sometimes it happens. It's a lineup with the T-steps. And for now, more damage inflicted. Keto just recovers the C4, but down to 56. Especially on Inferno. CZ and Inferno, Fnatic, like something weird always happens. Looks like it's all under control here for now, though. Four on two, Golden does with that save, and four doing great work of it. A couple of kills and the bomb down. Still a minute remains, however, and the smoke is available for the arch side. I'd assume that'll be deployed momentarily. The orb's just seeing if he can find the pick. We're told he's an aggressive player, but there's the smoke we're looking for. They've got options to go back to his B if required. Golden flashed off, but a low HP Zantara is waiting in front of him. Oh, Golden. Timing. Yeah, Rush no <gasps> will way. not get the frag. 2 HP? How did he not go down there? Bullet connects through the corner of the box, I believe. Yeah, I see. And it does 22 damage, that's it. That would, on that box, reinforced. Not the greatest smoke, but shouldn't affect the outcome of the round. I mean, he at least is working with the knowledge that they haven't crossed a pit. And that's a frag onto Zantaris. Searson, however, with the AWP. Ooh, the AWP I don't like so much. Molotov it now, like maybe it's a little bit too late. This oh, could get dicey. Yeah, oh, oh no, to the missed shot, yeah. Crims. Would have liked the safer play with the Molotov, but... Oh, Wait, he's, just, he's starting on him. He's just having fun. He's waiting for the music. It's like, it doesn't doom, even matter. Doom. This time into Keto. Oh, info for JW. Chance to catch Searson here. Revenge from the round before, where Searson won the Grenade. mid versus Arch duel, and another member of Big Clan goes down. This time permanently. Zantares catches the nade over the smoke. You can see him not quite going to pull the trigger there, Crims. He can just buy some time at this point. There's not a lot of it. 45 seconds. They've got the bomb isolated in T-Spawn. They pretty much have to go towards B at this point. And we can see Flush that he is a master with the SMGs. He's trying to show presence. He was a sandbags before. They got to clear this all out. And they're going in no utility, remember. Golden ready to spray him down. First one successful. Second will find the bomb. And it looks like the round is confirmed. Fnatic. Up middle they go. Crims just takes the fight now. He can fall back. They have a smoke for it, but he's choosing to throw some bullets between them. And another good nade looking promising. Doesn't quite find its target. Oh, Roland does, though, and it's straight through the smoke. Yep, that's what he does best sometimes, Alex. There's going to be a lot of damage inflicted here towards middle. There's HEs, Molotovs, bullets, uh, a lot of trouble for big. Oh. Not kill for the smoke. Zontaros will pull one back. That's what we like to see. It's at the very edge, and that's a nightmare. How is that happening? Seems a little off, and now I was, I was, the site why was the there? And why was it watching towards quad and no one watching apartments at all? Very strange. Perfect flash bang, good chip damage again. Oh my god, Flusher, could you stop? He's such a monster at this position. He'll be on the T side as well. Banana, but it belongs they to Flusher. Fight. I, I feel like with the advantage, they should have called it a day there because Flusher now he'll do well to even get one more kill on top of this. I don't think he will. I think he goes down. He needs a rotation. He needs JW to compete that angle like right now. JW can't sit in spawn. He needs to flash over and get stuck in with him. Flash is actually pretty decent oh. there. JW does arrive at the scene of the crime just in time there. And we have got ourselves a fanatic advantage. Flashbang towards Arch side. Tizian and Tamsin left to the impossible task here of trying to recover. Oh, it's a bit late. It's almost wasted at this point, that Molotov. They've got a, they can slow down the puzzle now. They've got themselves library. They can just see whether there's a pick available. JW would be a prime scalp to take if they can find it. It's up to Tizian to get it, though. A safe pair of hands. 
JW's potentially opening up the gap again here by worrying about too many angles. He could have dropped back more passively. He, he's trying to stay committed because he wants to make sure the two A defenders are not left on an island, but now he's given up a round that's yeah. doable. They, they could have just turtled up and pit and been fine. And you're absolutely oh, Flush is on. so smart, guys. He's not going to give them this fight until they, he absolutely needs to. And that's it's only 20 seconds. With 15 seconds now as well. He should do enough. He knows he just needs one kill. The prime target of the set. I don't know why they're going so slowly here, boys. You, you haven't left the at all. Yeah. Vision actually he has a plant. chance now. He can yeah. still do it. Safe plan will come through. That's all he had to do. Two versus one, no utility. Anyone want to take a bet? Ten, ten euros says he wins this. Uh, I think he wins it as well, so I won't take the bet. I think Tizian can do this. Brolin, Crims. They have a smoke and a molly here. Oh, he's just going to take the fight. He has to be really clean on the first. And Crims walks straight in. So clean. Be beautiful. Quad kill from Tizzy. They went for a very all-in banana play where Keto actually ran through two Molotovs. They've completely changed that to a whole passive vibe. Uh, passive, not the word I'd use right now for Crims. He's nearly got three. Practically, essentially, three. 2.9, 2 HP left for Zantares. Flush has taken another one. The healthy Keto, not so healthy anymore. And they don't have to do anything too flashy. This is a save. <laughs> so all the build up there, as we'll get into round number 14, we have got the Orpa JW looking down towards the underpass position, commits the T steps, and that's a brave pick to take. Let's just hold up, we want it's an action here. Yeah, we have, because Brolin is going to have to deal with three players from Big Clan. I love that one's already managed to sneak out to Quad. He's getting a whole lot of information for free. Interesting choice of the incendiary, avoids the nade relatively well, but that's the bomb actually on the balcony. Crim's connecting onto Zantaras with his AWP, and Keith having a very Oof. awkward duel with two towards CT. The chaos continues, now the site should be Big Clan's bomb in. And the hands oh my God. taken out. Now Tizian finding the head of Crim's 2v2. This just keeps on getting better and better. They still have haven't been able to retrieve the bomb. It's on the balcony and Searson is going to fall to Golden's push. Yeah, this is a great game of CS so far. Another clutch situation this time for Tizian. He stepped up before on a two versus one. Can he do it again? Fires off the gun to mask his footstep and he gets the first kill. Look at the awareness as well. This is beautiful so from Tizian. Good. Another clutch. Four kills in the round. A one versus two. Flasher and Golden are there with the lighter weaponry. First of which will be removed and Flasher oh, no. quickly after the lots of things here. One more bullet will do it. They've got so much time in store with three smokes. They're just trying to bait out whatever the CTs have, get some intel. Now they know the orcs on that side of the map. Are they fully committing off this? Bloody hell, Keto. That's a hell of a pick. <laughs> in he goes, the wide swing. I respect it. Knowing that JW has the orb and he's in the open, he can only get one kill essentially, right? He played him out. Or zero, if Keto's got anything to say about it. Look at the economy of utility here for Big. They've taken the bomb site, they've planted the bomb, and they still have two individuals with a smoke and a Molotov. Respectively, that's enough to deny the retake completely uh, right uh, there. You can have all of these you want, bro, and I don't think you'll be winning this uh, round. Uh, I take it back somewhat, but he has got 9 HP. Great effort, not gonna lie. That's the smoke lineup, thanks, bro, Lan. That is the smoke lineup. So he's got 9 HP, he needs two more kills, and to be fair, he has a kid. Oh my god, you wouldn't. This would actually be insane. There was absolutely no reason. Oh my god. He's throwing the molly in the right place. Oh my god. Thompson will get the frag, but Brolin, another red, impossible scenario. All oh, right. We're off to the races, Alex. It's aggression. That's what we'd like to see here. Your vocal cords are about to be warmed up. What have you got for me? Absolutely nothing because at the moment, back and forth in middle, Tizian continuing where he left off in the first half. A double kill, and he's perhaps not quite done. What's going on there? Flusher, yet to throw a bullet in his return, and he gets chipped away at. Golden's been thrown into a one versus two. So whether this is... By design, I'm not sure, but at this point, he's just going for it. Knowing there's going to be one player at either side of the map, he might as well take a straight-up duel, fast as you like. It's got a nimble pistol in the form of the Glock. Uh, he has no armor, however, and now no head. Tabson takes care of that. Denies absolutely everything. Catches him the smoke out as well. Well, I think we've given you a great storyline there, Alex. Now this is your moment. So you guys... really... Get us into the excited mode. Let's go. I love it when you put me on the spot. <laughs> so much fun. Uh, Keto is going to be throwing the bullet through the smoke and will catch the first one to Golden Fnatic now having to operate with just four. JW catches Ooh. another one and the bullet's through the smoke. All blind when 4v3 as the smoke does start to fade. A second replaces it. Here we oh. go. That's There's a, a shot from Sis. Is that from the smoke? I think that was over the top. He was trying to jump up at the first oranges. Oh, okay. This is the moment we were talking about. Remember, if big win this round, there's no chance for any Fnatic to be able to stabilize. There's a big kill, though, from Flusher coming in towards that banana area. And now Crims, he knows he has to be active. He can all sit back towards Emo, but it looks like he's got a great cross that placement here. The spray's good, but down to the Molly, two versus one. Century. Oh, has he got it? It looks good. There's it no looks way. really good. He can sit it. He can sit it. He's burning. He's burning. He's burning. 
It's done, oh. he's just done it. He wins the round. Flushes and Sendry has secured <laughs> it for Fnatic. There was going to be the twist of the knife. But remember, as we said, as long as you got a few kills there, you would actually be at, in my book, you Better win the position. round. Well, there we have it. JW, the rest of the course towards middle, but that's straight towards library. Crims dodges the flashbang to Tara's and fires off some shots, gives up the position. They have mid control, but Sissi looking to shut that down. But Golden, great shot. Fantastic work from the in game leader. Yeah, he's in trouble now. Sissi's going to have to get more than one. Does get the bomb in his grasp, tries to transition into Brolin. Not quite enough, but Santara's arriving just in the nick of time as the nade. The palms of Brolin. Good catch, but bullet chunks down Santara's, but he no. still stands his ground for one. A clutch on the cards for Flusher. Yeah. Galo in hand, no nades. Up against Keto and Tabson. Remember, Tabson took a lot of damage at the start, but he has he snuck through the smoke. Through. He wins this because Flusher won't expect it. He thinks that the veil of the smoke will protect him, which is fair enough. Very nice play from Tabson. Uh, the two on ones, you've got to take some risks sometimes. Uh, we had yep. Navi just go down to north. Fnatic coming in here is another clear favorite. Obviously, there are certain conditions which, which do play in the favor of certain teams, but still, it's, it's the level of loss, right? It's they look like they're getting more blown out and you can see a little bit of frustration i think probably jw would be a perfect example his play style is normally the one giving out the frustration Ooh. Tizian tested again this time he's only going to get the one and a nice response from keto just arriving in library to make sure this doesn't spiral now zantara's only has to find one job done back turned and just tucking into the site in time to find Ooh. flusher on the bow Love. Really nice shot there from Zontara. Should be able to close things out, no problem. But Crims, he's got other ideas. Be careful here. Waiting. Crims has made the right choice. Low HP player, but not quite going to be able to connect the shots. And so that will go the way of Big Clan 15 secured. And an overtime minimum. Here, as we find ourselves in round number 23, maybe the last round. Look at oh. Keto just charging in. Flush has just had a maid in his hand. That's how much he wasn't expecting it. Be finished from Fnatic. They've got two smokes. Uh, I think it's a contact play. Really flash over. Hope for the best here, boys, as we'll see the incendiary land. Keto looks like he's trying for a couple of kills. It's Brunan to take him down, but Tapson, he's an absolute unit. He will find the 16 7 scoreline. Fnatic will have one smoke and some flashbangs. We're seeing a lot of teams favor the B bomb side, especially with this sort of pace. You'll see if they get that first frag. It's Tizian, who's been completely smoked off. He won't have much backup. They focus completely towards the A side. It was a stack from big towards A with retake mentality towards B. Bomb planted now. That's courtesy of Golden. And here comes Zontaras with his P2000. And looking to crack things open. Ooh, Ooh, he's doing the flashbang dance, but his scroll wheels up against him. Tabson Why? looking to get some sort of opportunity back. JW's done well to find two. In fact, he's close to overtaking his Inferno finish on the frags. Taps into the head of one. Brolin unable to get towards Monster. So now a 2v2. No utility, but there is a kit for Tizzy. He is going to start to pull it. Halfway gone and contesting no. assists. And JW checks just in the nick of time. And now a 1v1. JW is on for four here. I need Chad, can you check how many frags he had in Inferno? Thank you. Tizzy. Rather, Searson trying to fake it out. He's not got time, and it's all JW. He's trying to show Bo. He's trying to slash, but it will be four for Searson, round Fnatic. JW throw the Molotov at the start, but he is greeted by the old shot. Tizian as well through the flames. is going to be a nice five on three advantage for Big here. Still a chance in the round here. Good timing. He has snuck through, and it will get Tizian as well. A chance now for Fnatic. Yeah, and just retreating off. Who was that? It was Tapson, unwilling to take the fight, but now he stands his ground. He has the support of Zantares, and that could be enough to dissuade them. Look at Fnatic, scarpering now towards the short side of the tunnel. However, Brolin. If you want anybody alive from Fnatic this late in the round, it would be these two individuals, but this aggressive play right here could be the undoings. And Taris, will he check left? Is this going to be... Uh... That's a freebie. You don't love to see it. So that's the B bombs I open. Your, your solo B player has pushed and given the round up potentially here. Fnatic can't believe their luck. This was a five on three to kick things off. And for now, a two on two. It's going to be Searson, though, looking to deny the plan. Not going to happen. Great smoke utilization from Fnatic here. Crimson Brolan looking for the first kill. Brolan makes some noise with the jump up, and that will cost him his life. Crimson out towards Shaw. They know exactly where he is. They can smoke him out, but they might not get the chance. That's a smoke on the floor now. Oh! Searson hits the shot, but only down to 10 HP. He has to pull out the pistol at this stage to win the round. He smoke. can smoke the bomb, which he has done. Or did he smoke Shaw? Went for the latter. No kids. And he's only got the orb. He can't spam. How did he win this round, Chad? Uh, I think this one. He's only he, he's only a kill, right? Yeah. He yeah. A, yeah, he had to do something. He, he, he should have smoked the bomb and defused at least put pressure on the T. I haven't seen many... Well, There's one. there you go, Chad. Perfect time. 
for Searson to deliver exactly what you talked about. Speak of the devil and he shall come. Keto does get another frag. A chance onto Golden. Converted. 4v3. Throw it again. He's playing another chance. No. To w, how do you get away with that one? Charges into the toilets and he hasn't stopping with this charge just yet. He knows there's a gap in the defense and he wants to exploit it. Catches a glimpse of Santares and he actually hits the shot. Now the site is theirs and likely the round. The CTs, they're scrambling. Tabson from behind. Flash up. Watching the extremities, just ready to pounce. Has to move. Look at the time. Well, he timed the perfection. Look at him go. Tabson had to give in at some point, and now Tizzy needs another two versus one here to save the day. To get the first round on the board. Good effort with the damage inflicted towards JW. He gets the kill, but remember, he has to defuse that bomb still. Goes oh. to the AWP. I don't mind that at all, but he takes a pop shot. Doesn't work out away. For him, and he has to fall back at this stage. Decent effort there, but has to save the AWP. Fnatic, and he'll go down with the bomb. Doesn't actually work out for him in any way whatsoever. Fnatic go for those kind of plays all the time. Yep. But you never know how to predict this. it. Look, no scoping. Come on. That's the yours. weary Turkish ground. What are they called? What are the, what are <laughs> the guys who come, down small. come knocking on your door? Are they called hawk witnesses? No, hawkers? Are they called hawkers? Um, uh, is this an Australian or Maybe hawkers. it's an Australian thing. But well, hold on, they might win a pistol round here. It's a little bit more aggressive, that 5-7. Ambitious with the range, as you can see. He hits three bullets, but doesn't do much damage. That's much better, though. JW will be removed. The smoke takes away vision from Zantara's there. And Keto, prime position to actually win this round. Surely they can convert this one. It's going to be a there three versus go. zero. It is with the pistols. Becoming potentially a negative, but it is a fast change of pace. It really is. Flusher went straight through that Molotov. He still gets a frag. Gets the first blood. JW makes the second. And already the site under threat, Zantares, he's desperately trying to hold on to any sort of ground. He's thrown off his incendiary, trying to keep JW at bay. Crim's behind him, Golden's crawling through jail. And it does feel like it's actually Zantares, the one imprisoned. He is got surrounded by Swedes. The wrought iron bars in this metaphor. Nice work from Zantares. There's another chance for a um, big plan to support. And another one. Finally, Zantares wakes up in a crucial round of our second map. Yeah, he has been absent for the entirety of Overpass so far, but that's a big moment for him as we get into the two-on-two. -two. JW hits these, though, and Keita will be removed. A two versus one. It's Searson coming in from the heaven position. An ungodly play required here. He has got one smoke and a flashbang. Oh, Misses the first. Wow. No kid, bear in mind. That bomb goes down. He's in a lot of trouble. He won't even get the chance as JW gets his third kill of the round there. So this is what Fnatic started doing at Pro League uh, last year. Mm -hmm. They managed to do the double incendiary towards Playground and the T-Step denying full access there, meaning you have to have a dumb smoke still or a G-Grenade. So let's have a look at that maybe later on as this round develops. So great Deagle headshot from Golden and Brolan with the AK-47. Make it a Galil. They've got the advantage. But this is a very difficult buy for them in the final round here of the first half. Oh, big clan. Yeah, they're so shaken. They're going to have JW on the dankest of flanks. And Flusher already finding blood is only boding one way. As Antares would have to adjust so fast. Golden on the edge of the smoke will find him. They know it has to be big flank because of JW. So this is all over. Yeah, with the AWP again, he's got all the resources, but has to go to the Deagle. Doesn't look like he's got much of a chance. One kill maybe, but defuse this bomb and it's already halfway gone. I don't think so, kid. Down he goes. It's going to be flushed out to find them a very convincing first half there. 12 to 3 from Fnatic up. They're giving up Inferno. What just yeah. happened? It's been hitting the gym for a solid three, four months. No way, they couldn't. There was T, it was T stairs that they were coming up. I think it was a duel with Flusher. Okay. Check oh, he had a defuse kit, so he had an HE. He must have done as well. So jumping around the corner, Golden does get traded out. So Tabson now into the site. There is still one lingering. I believe it's Crimson to Graffiti side. It is. Rollin, however, catching Tizian before that bomb could go down, and they keep coming. Another frag, and there's Brolin onto Searson. Just leaves Tabson into a rather tough circumstance in the open. Crims will finish it, and we have ourselves Fnatic doing what they had to in order to find us that third map mirage as soon as possible. Big Clan, if you have just joined us, by the way, and it sounds all dreary. Held onto that USP as to what was highlighted within the first half with his block round. So, look, there is an opportunity. Oh. I don't think he's expecting this by any means. Well, Flusher wasn't expecting to still be alive after catching those nades right square on the nose. With he one HP! It. You got us. You've got to stop him. Somebody has to. He still gets a frag. 
He had the USB only then, right? Yeah. yeah. That was his, that's his thing. We talked about that in the first half. And uh, for reasons Chad stated, maybe not the best call, but they, they win the round, so don't worry about it. It's all good. <laughs> Before I can even finish the point, it will be a convincing victory for Fnatic. That's going to be map point Mirage. What's Flasher up to? He surely doesn't do the same thing again. I reckon he wise. He waits for the nades. They're just having fun, aren't they? They really are. Oh, free fire and a triple in quick succession. JW's going to be the one to find the third. And yeah, this one's all said and done. I don't think JW's going to let off the gas. He still wants to fight. He might even consider a repeat. No, nope, not going to be playing this foolishly. And look at that supportive flash all the way from B. Perfect. They want to get this one over and done with, but it has in their hurry, in their haste, perhaps gone a little too aggressive. Lost one, but this advantage from Big Clan is still a long way away. Tizian's trying to get the info, but he catches bullets and crims through the smoke, <laughs> actually catching his partner. Not the one he wanted, but he'll take it all the same. We are going to have a two-on-one now. Tizian, five seconds. Oh, he gets the frag he was hoping There's for. A chance. And now he's got a real shot. He can run and at least get that bomb down. No, we're going to have Golden up there. Oh, not quite in time. So there is a good chance now. This is for the ace. An ace clutch oh, to save though, Big Clan. Oh. Keeps him alive. 28 HP. He has to be so damn precise. Pull the trigger first onto the head of Golden. He knows where he is. Good shots. They connect. And an ace clutch from Tizian. He continues his spree. Keeps Zantara's attention. They split up. Pre-fire. Oh. Wild shots, but they don't connect. And that's huge because now Brolin can stay here and now he could very well win the round. He rips the boost out. A flash from Flusher to ensure survival. And that should very well be the last round big C on overpass. The change, my mind, is Keto. He walks up first, a smoke from his teammates to ensure he can take this fight. But it seems that Flush has been given some quasi cover. He loves it and will peek out to secure the last or penultimate frag. The last, it will be Searson. He stands up against four. 40 seconds and just a matter of time. Yeah, it'll be Brolin. Confirms it. We're going to Mirage. The, the drums into this the crazy combat. push. Yeah. yeah, look at him go. Brolin does go down on his push. They're going through middle here, up through connector. No so. one's contesting it at all. Look at that. They can just charge on him. Keto will clear out jungles. And Tara's ar arriving from Palace and Fnatic. They still have their ace in the hole. It's Crims. And he's already got one in a second. Now the bomb's underneath dark. He's completely set up for this one. Tantaris, he's banging through, but not connecting. And now with 2v2, it's not looking impossible for Big Clan. No, actually looks pretty promising, to be honest with you. 40 seconds remaining. It's nice moves from JW to get in towards that window, but Keto has heard him. Going to be investigating that area. Can jump up with the bench himself, but it will also make a sound cue. Big headshot towards JW, down to 13 points of health. Unlucky for some. We'll see what he can make of it. 20 seconds remain. Bomb looks likely to be planted here. CT's just turtling up together towards the connector and window positions. At a default plant, absolutely fine. Quick flash towards CT spawn and some Glock shots just to make sure the C4 gets planted. There's a kit available. Flash it out. Very exposed. JW, I feel like he hits this shot. He absolutely does. He crawls his way in from CT steps and Zantaris with just 16 points of health here. A pre-fire in this position will take him down. That's exactly what comes through. Big pickup for Fnatic. And Zantaras will swallow an HE grenade at the start. Tabson, yes. Think better of that, my friend. He'll pull back. Crimson on the other side, but that could be an opportunity. Waiting for his chance to strike there. Equal kill for now. We're going to have a 4-4. Four and four. JW, though. Great oh, shot. He'll finish oh. this off. He'll finish it off. Don't worry about that. Straight to the dome of Kizo. There's no way they expect this, though. Oof. Sandwich oh, play. He checks, and Zantaras. Does go down to 33, but that's the way into the A site. I will note, though, that the bomb's now just, only just now been retrieved from the carnage in middle. Taps in a very promising frag. Santares making good on the promise his teammate made, and that should be the round. It looks like Flush has accepted his fate. Smoke now thrown in towards Connector, and towards a jungle position as well. Flash is over, and here they come. Nice connection from JW, just immediately nullifies the first prong of the mid assault. Coming in from all directions, and another one, Palace separated. Two now remaining. Finally, Tamsin enters the feed and keeps things level. 2v2. Bomb's not going to go down just yet. It's Searson to try and do so, but Flusher, he has got a nade calculated and will manage to keep the attention drawn. Golden connects, and now Searson, what can you do with this? He, Is he going round? He can see the bomb. It's planted for connector side, and he knows it as well. Would have liked to have made that jump, to be honest with you, but the smoke down makes oh, things very Molly's complicated. Useless. Uh, we'll see where he can. Is it get? Oh, I like it. If he just gets in the smoke, Chad, and just starts knifing people. What's the molly gonna do, mate? What's he doing? 
Oh, is it a massive gap? Oh, I thought he was trying to fake that he was far away. And they've seen the situation so many times on the high level that they instantly know how to react. JW will see the player walking down towards middle, but it's just going to be an A explosion. Yeah, I mean, explode they will. Look at Tizian. He's pretty up on sandbag. Roland is doing his very best over that. Smoke, what a kill and a half. And then some. Oh, oh JW. You that... don't, don't see that every day. No, you do not. I didn't think he stood a chance to Alec. Bomb side itself, just the opposite side of default. So he's gonna have to get his skates on here, but he could find them oh towards connector. God, this could look. be good for a couple of kills. There's the first, but it gives us position. It wasn't multiple potential, and unfortunately, it doesn't lead to too much now. Incendiary available, smoke on the bomb has to come in right now. Bomb is looking very good for big. Where's the defuse coming in? Incendiary, Molotov's thrown oh, over. The shot it's doesn't gonna be close. It's gonna be a defuse coming through, and the shot has to connect, it. and it works out for big. I don't think that was time regardless, but there it is. They stick the landing and taps in with the long flying from B. He only gets one kill, but it slows them down tremendously. Oh, who's that running towards B? That's Tizian. He has had some convincing moments where he'll run into an area, pull rotations yeah. over. You see, there's still three players towards B right now with the bomb outside A. He sold it pretty well. Down to Brolin then. And JW already. They seem to be working good unison for the first duels. It's two for one and favors Fnatic. Tabson often sneaking into CPL. Crims is bottom at the top of that ladder, but he doesn't check it. Timing an absolute nightmare. And Tabson's not ready for this at all. This looks like another Fnatic round. You say 10-5, looking likely at least for the eighth. Another uncharacteristic kind of move there from Crims. He obviously thought that was an AK. He's picked it up, it's the Galil, and then he's fumbled back to the M4 and then Made immediately gone on down. So, Obviously, the lower weaponry there, luring him into a bit of a trap. I guess I didn't see the bullets left in the clip. Maybe he had like four or five in the M4, was ready for a quick second kill. That's all I can think of. But yeah, as soon as he rose at the Galil, did not work out. But still, they have the three on two. In terms of utility, one smoke for Flusher. Golden with nothing, but his positioning is good so far. You can see very tentative hold towards B. Shadow, not the cleanest of kills, but that will absolutely do. 25 seconds, Keita will bait out this plant, surely. He's actually committed to it. Golden thinks he's gonna bake it out potentially, but just wanted to get the cash if possible, not gonna work out for him. Time will tell. Seems to be aware of it. Smoke down for now, Tabson. Gives Big the advantage. Oh, he's gonna take himself in that I like corner. This. He hasn't yeah. been there once, right? This is like once, once a half. They usually say Zantara's looking very poised to check it though, and the pre-fire is quick. No issues so far for Big Clan. The issue from Flushers short-lived. Only one should very well be the round. Look at Tabson's position. He's surely going to catch Crimp there, and he's going to get. wanted to check it. That was that was an if though. Those two letters, a rather important component of the sentence. And woo, Searson did already open things up with quite the bang. The heads J Dubs, and now into the site they flood. Four members of Fnatic remain, and already Brolin, bullet in his brain. Down now to three. Fnatic standing oh, rather tall. Crims, this is gonna really suck. No kit, admittedly, but two smoke grenades. How will Fnatic deal with this? Looking to find it. anything. He's on it already. Tapping away. Tabson's still on oh. it, but slicing. It's gonna be flush with. <laughs> the knife <laughs> of course it's flusher with the knife searson looking towards top of middle for any players trying to get towards those mid boxes but the smoke is down to block his vision grenades coming in as well but does take minimal damage to 25 there trying to break through they know he has to reload but roland doesn't find a point of approach just yet down he goes on tara's a nice double kill that's a huge way to hold off the push i love the brolin flight path just didn't pay off but Zantara's a whole spray oh and he's not stopping he wants four it will be tizian to finish off that fourth he started well he looks like he fancies one good job taking down keto there with five house. seconds remaining he's done a lot of damage there hold on to the ak he's still got 4200 cash reserve so he can still drop him it hasn't got double digits just yet but searson taking the game to them pushing towards that underpass position taps it. how are you alive well that will explain it not for much longer and searson will have to react to this and he's got himself a kill i think there is a player towards kitchen boom nails it couple of them found advantage big an aggressive orping Searson even had the support of Tabson. That was a, a coordinated maneuver to have Tabson in support from behind. Now Searson looking to do exactly what JW has just done to Keto. Close quarters orping. His shot misses, but a second chance perhaps. JW smartly maneuvering his way 
back into safety. You have no idea what his in could be. Yeah, but then the reality is you don't know what's happened in middle while you were gone. You don't know if the door's locked behind you, and so they take the fight, Ooh. and Flusher, he wins it. A chance now for Fnatic, manufactured by the star of the Fnatic show. He's not quite ready for Zantara's, though. And um, this could be in too, a little too much for J-Dubs. This is the problem. So as soon as that first play gets to kill, sure, it's great from Flush to even find that quick first one, but now it's left the orb with no options whatsoever. Searson closes them out. A little bit of information, a breadcrumb. That's another big. opening. And he's done it again. Pretty sick stuff. They're not really giving you much to work with the smoke. It's starting to dissipate, but the CTs, they're pushing for Inter. They could find the bomb, chat. Oh, they could legit easy. find the bomb. All this timing right seconds. here, he's dropping back to get it right now. If JW goes down, he'll have a knife out. Yep, he'll just run to get the bomb. He might even run into them. Yep, round over. Uh, that's a nightmare. Oh, Shouldn't boy. be happening. I mean, you, you, I feel like you were having this rant yesterday, Ch Henry. Chad was having it, saying Chad the amount was? of time he's called his teammates, why is the bomb in T-spawn? It's not a very safe place. <laughs> and it's not it's, the best uh, place to leave. It's a very place to go back. They're very far, <laughs> far away. You do hate to see that. The fact that I get to see it all building up as well, he's going to knife out with the open his back and his guy. He's going to be the most frustrated man in the world. And uh, we will see touching distance now of Big taking down Fnatic here. So as he lands default. The default on the bomb side. There you go. Do they throw a smoke on top of it? No. Instead, you can see. Keto, vision present and quick trade from Braun. His CZ always seems to find one in these kind of rounds, and the smokes are good enough to get that bomb down uncontested. Now the retake question is asked of Big. These are the rounds Fnatic win. Just when they need How? a miracle, this is when it works out. They've got an M4 him. in the hands of Brodan. Tizian saw him by the looks of things. Brodan comes back, flash comes through. Nice flash, fan. This will be very effective. Look at the play for coming through. There's the flash, and we do have the advantage once again for Big. But the P250 in the back, not quite enough. Zantarez, he will mow down JW. It's not going to be enough if a flush there. He comes in for the flank once again. But the bomb, it's going to be defused any second. He'll come through, maybe deny something here. Not oh. going to happen. <laughs> Bigger one, nine on the trot. They have looked fantastic on this CT side. And I was talking up their T half. Yeah, I mean, I guess diversifying as Tito, he manages to get himself one and even get away just for a moment. Santares, they're getting closer. Flush is gone. No Two way. frags away. Fnatic look like it's they're happening. falling. It's happening. Golden desperately trying to pull something back, but they have done it. Big clan. Berlin International Gaming gets off to a flying start in the Pro League.